Question number 4 says find the sum of all numbers between 200 and 400 which are divisible by 7. Sum of all numbers between 200 and 400. Okay. Which are divisible by 7. So 200. Is 200 divisible by 7? What, what 200 is not directly divisible by 7. What's the remainder that you get on dividing 200 by 7? Is uh, 1. Basically 2 is 14. 14 and then you have 60. So you needed 63, right? So 203 will be divisible by 7. Yes. Okay. 203 over here will be divisible by 7. Sum of all numbers. So numbers divisible by 7 will be 207 sorry 203 not 207 203 okay then next number will be 210 next number will be 217 and so on and so forth up till which number which number will you get next so 400 if you divide 400 by the 7 uh, frankly speaking, 350 is divisible by 7. 350 and 350 plus 49 is 399. 399 is divisible by 7. Yes. 399. Now, 399 divided by 7 will give you 5 and 7. 57 as the quotient, right? This is what you get. Remainder will be 0, obviously, since this is divisible. So, this is the sequence that we get. And this is an arithmetic progression, if you can clearly observe. Yes, common difference is 7. First term is 203 and the last term a n is 3 double 9 and we are asked to find s n for finding s n we need n first of all right and n can be obtained with the help of this so a n is equal to a plus n minus 1 d which tells me 3 double 9 is equal to 2 0 3 plus n minus 1 times 7 Okay, 399 minus 203. What is that equal to? This is 196 is equal to n minus 1 times 7. And that tells me n minus 1 will be equal to 196 upon 7. What is that? 140 is 20 and 28 is what I get. This is 28, which tells me n is equal to 29. That's one thing. Okay. Therefore, Sn, which will be n by 2. 2a plus n minus 1 d or we can use n by 2 a plus a n first term plus last term that's what you can use first term is equal to a n is 29 by 2 in the bracket you have a, a which is 203 and plus a n which is 3 double 9 this is what you get so 500 99 602 Okay, this is 29 by 2 into 602. What is that? 29 into 301 is what I get. Right? Let's multiply that. 29 into 1 is 29. 29 into 0 carried forward is 2. will come over here. 29 times 3. What is that? 87. So, this is 8729 and that is my required answer for this question number 4th as you can see over here.